Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. It's Deanna, also known as Dee's Curve. If you are new here, I post plus size fashion, travel, and lifestyle related videos. Definitely consider hitting that subscribe button. You will enjoy my content, I promise you, okay? If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for clicking on yet another video. Today's video is gonna be full of information if you plan on attending Dominica's Carnival next month. I can't believe Carnival is next month. So I am going to be sharing all the events, all the locations of the events, the times, the cost, where to buy tickets, all the events that you should have on your list. If you're still a little bit confused as to which event to go to, this video is for you. I will highly encourage you guys to share this video I feel like a lot of people talk about Carnival in February and they think Trinidad Carnival, but there's multiple, there's another Carnival happening, okay? And that's Dominica's Carnival, which is just as much as a vibe, which is a Carnival you should definitely consider coming to, okay? If it's not, if it's too late this year, definitely plan for next year, um, because Dominica's Carnival, definitely, I would highly encourage everyone to experience it. It's like no other Carnival, okay? But that's not what this video is about. It's about the events leading up to Carnival. Gone are the days when we didn't have any events. Now we have events up, I mean really, the time that I'm filming this video, there's events already happening and we're still in January. So most of us are not fortunate enough to go to Dominica in January. Most of us are probably coming like, the week or two weeks before actual carnival so i'm going to start with the events that are happening in february if you're good if you're interested in that keep on watching so at the time i'm filming this video we have already had the official opening of carnival which is a huge parade that happens in the capital which is rozo however there are some villages that have their own opening and so you can look out for that that's of course if you're in dominica the Portsmouth, the town of Portsmouth, which is our second town, is having their opening on the 20th of January. I know Signal Band is going to be there. Again, if you're in Dominica, definitely consider going to Portsmouth opening, right? But we're going to talk more about the events in February. So the first event, and of course you guys already know, I have my notes, okay? Because I will not be able to remember all of this without my notes. But the first event, which is happening on... February 10th starts at 9 p.m. until it's called That Is Carnival. So this is the first event in February. This is going to be like a jam, okay? It is going to be at the Stadium Forecourt, which is in Roseau. And Signal Band is going to be performing. Triple K is going to be performing. Um, Allison Hines, which is like, you know, the queen of Soka is going to be performing. So this, the lineup is looks really good. Um, we have Unstoppable DJs, Kenny G is gonna be on there as well. So this is a real packed lineup. This, if you're in Dominica on February 10th, I would highly recommend that you go to the event. The cost to attend this event is $50. That's if you buy it in advance, $70 at the gates, and then $200 for VIP. So they do have a VIP option, which is like all drinks inclusive and so on and so forth so that is kind of a that is said to be a really really good event it is like a jam as we would call it in dominica 9 p.m until and you know dominicans don't like to go home so i can already tell that may be a big a, a, a day fit i mean a day break fit so put that one in your calendar the second event is soca raft up or soca raft up i don't know why i want to say raft but it's actually raft up and this one is a Saturday, February 11th. This is a boat party. And I believe that may be one of two boat parties that they're having. Now, I couldn't find a lot of like information about this event in terms of like flyers. I was only able to find a video on um, Instagram from the promoters page. I don't know where the flyers are at, but I was still able to find all the information Soka Raft Up happens throughout the Caribbean, so it's not gonna. This is not the first time that this event is happening, so I'm, I'm thinking it's gonna be good. And I really, really wish 
that I was there for this event, but unfortunately I won't be there yet. But this one is, as I said, it's a boat party. They will start boarding at 2.30 p.m. So more than likely it's gonna go from 2.30 up until the sun sets. That's gonna be a vibe. I don't think it's an event where you like jump into the water or anything like that. Not that type of party, but you're gonna be on a boat. Something about being a boat is such a vibe. Something about being a boat is such a vibe. Like, I don't know, when I'm on a boat, to me, like the alcohol hits different. When you, I don't know if it's the motion of the ocean or what it is, but alcohol hits different when you're on a boat. So if you're in Dominica on February 10th, I would highly recommend this uh, event as well. You can buy uh, you can buy tickets at islandtickets.com. I will put all the information in the description box, like all the links, all the costs, everything will be in the description box. Event and the first event that I will be attending is Wine Down, and I am very very excited for Wine Down. Wine Down is being put on by Incognito and Fetters Inc., so they're kind of collaborating on this event, and I'm very excited for this event. This event, the theme for it is the Vineyard Experience. It's a classic and unique type of event. A little bit more on the bougie side, and you guys know that's the type of thing that I like, okay? Um, there's gonna be DJs there, and of course, they're still continuing to post more about performers and stuff like that and artists, but it's mostly gonna be DJs, but Incognito puts on the best events, and so I have really, really high hopes for this event. I'm actually one of their ambassadors, so if you have questions about tickets and so on and so forth definitely leave them in the comments i'll be happy to answer those questions for you so um at this event like y'all this event is gonna be good i'm just very very excited about it it's 40 dollars um 40 us dollars in advance that's 100 ec dollars you can buy tickets at eventbrite.com again i will put all that information in the description box below and this event is happening in Mero, which is a village in Dominica. And it's gonna be at the Villa Pampamus, Pampamus, I think that's how you call it. But it's a location that has like the best views during sunset. And this is, as the name suggests, it's called Wind Down. So it is an evening event. It's from um, 2 to 10 p.m. So it's a vibe, it's gonna be a vibe. This is definitely one of the events you need to attend. So if it's not on your list, write it right now. Go to the website and get your tickets right now. So moving right along, we are now on Wednesday, February 15th, and this is the first event of many for Signal Band and Fantasy Tribe. This event is the first of its kind, First time it's happening, and I know it's not gonna be last, but this event is called Roll Call. Now this event is specific to Fantasy Tribe members only. So you have to be registered with Fantasy Tribe to come to Roll Call. And I will tell you more about Fantasy Tribe. I am one of the influencers, ambassadors for Fantasy Tribe. So you're gonna see me at all the Fantasy Tribe events, okay? That's just what it is, okay? And I'm gonna hype up all these events. I'm actually very, very excited for Roll Call because again, it's it's my type of event. It's, it's gonna be a bougie event, okay? It's gonna be a bougie event and I'm very excited for it. But um, Roll Call is an all-inclusive, upscale type of evening event. If that's your vibe, register for Fantasy Tribe because there's no additional cost. This event is actually included in your Fantasy Tribe registration, so you're getting all these events for one cost. And you'll hear me talk about more events that's included in this um, in this like bundle, right? Uh, you can buy tickets or register for this event at fantasytribe.com. All of that information will be down below. It is Wednesday, February 15th from 6 to 10 p.m. because you know, Wednesday is a working day, we don't have the day off, so we're not gonna end too, too late, but this is gonna be a really nice event, and this event will be held at the Old Mill Cultural Center. 
really looking forward to this one um the theme basically you have to dress in the color of your costume so i'm gonna be playing with um golden sulfur that's my section and so i gotta step with like goldish yellowish outfit so depending on the color of your of your costume that's the color of your outfit so they say that it's gonna be like there's probably prizes to be won and you know you kind of get to meet the people that you're gonna be playing mass with which is always fun so if you're not registered for a carnival band yet highly recommend fantasy tribe and all of the information will be down below the next event is a sunrise and you guys I don't have much information about this event except that it's on Friday February 17th I, I don't know they have this event supposedly every year and it's normally really good I don't know where the information is at. I was told that it would be available soon. I don't know what soon is because it's a month from the event. But that's neither here nor there. I will probably update the, the, the description box as soon as I get information about it. But as of today, all I know is there's an event called Sunrise. It's happening. That's all I know. Okay? <laughs> Okay, you guys, so the agenda is starting to get real packed. Okay, from now on is pace yourself. No more breaks in between because right now we are on the Saturday before Carnival and it's nonstop. It's events after events after events. You gotta decide which event you're going to. Probably take half of this event and then half of another one because you can't go to both. Like, just pace yourself from here on out. Okay, so the first event that's happening on Saturday is called Stranded at the Beach. This is a first event of its kind. This is actually happening in Portsmouth. So most of the events that I mentioned already is gonna be happening in the Roseau area. This is the first and I think only event that I have heard of that's happening in Portsmouth. This is a beach party. It's happening per on Purple Turtle Beach, which is a very, very popular beach, one of the more popular beaches in Dominica. And it's also well known, like they always throw parties on that beach. This is a bikini type vibe, okay? There's even an opportunity to win a trip to Miami's carnival. So you're gonna wanna go to this one. It is, as I said, on Purple Turtle's Beach. It's happening Saturday, February 18th from noon to about 6 p.m. It's 60 EC regular tickets that you can buy in advance, 250 EC for VIP tickets, and then $75 if you wait to purchase at the gate. I don't believe that there's an online link for purchasing tickets. All I saw on, the, on their flyer is that you can purchase it at Purple Turtle or you can purchase it at the Family Dental Practice, which is a dental practice in Rozo. Purpose, of course, is in Portsmouth. So this is a very exciting event. As I said, this is the first time that they're having it. But what's Carnival without a beach event? We need a beach event. So I'm very excited about this one as well. Now we are still on Saturday, okay? Because as I told you, it's pace CSL from here on out. The next event, which is a highly anticipated, very, very popular event. This has happened in Miami. This is gonna be the second time in Dominica? I don't think, so no, the third time in Dominica because they had it in 2019. 2020, we had Carnival, so I believe they had it then too. And then of course in 2021, we didn't really have the traditional Carnival. We were one of the few islands who had Carnival in 2020 because obviously our Carnival is in February and that thing that we won't talk about happened, well, exploded kind of in March. So I believe they had it in 2020 as well. But it is a Viva La Carnival. I went in 2019 and it was a vibe. It was a vibe. It is a cooler fet type of event. So you want to bring your cooler with your drinks. And quite frankly, I, I kind of like cooler fets. I don't have a problem with them. I am an ambassador as well for this event. So I will put my own personal code down below to purchase tickets. But tier three tickets are out and they are very, very limited. I will not recommend you wait last minute to buy tickets for this event because this is a very, very popular event. So this one is Viva La Carnival. It's on the Savannah in Newtown, Saturday, February 15th. You can't miss it. 
Okay, this is not the one to miss. So Viva La Carnival is not the event to miss. The prom the event um, organizers, they do a really good job at this event. It's a vibe every year. I'm going to be there, party with these curve, okay? <laughs> but no, seriously, this is a really, really good event. I'm very excited for it. And I will put the information on how to purchase tickets down in the description box, also on the screen here so you can see it. But you guys should be taking notes. You should have your phone out right now and you should be taking notes because I'm giving you all the good information in one place, okay? You don't have to go searching on all of the different promoters pages. You could just get it right here. Okay, so we are done with Viva and we're trying to get a little bit of rest, okay? A little bit of rest throughout the night. However, we're gonna start the next day, which is Sunday, February, what is it? Sunday, February 19th. We're starting the day at band practice, okay? Band practice is another event by Signal Band that is included in your registration. That is two events so far. That is included in your Fantasy Tribe registration. Also with um, this event, if you are in Illumination, which I will talk more about, if you are in Illumination, you can also attend this event if you are a VIP. Let me clarify that. If you are a VIP ticket holder of Illumination, you can attend this event, and this event is called Band practice this is gonna be kind of like a chill event kind of block style that band is gonna be doing sound check and practicing and stuff and you're gonna come have drinks it's gonna be like an organized type of thing but it's gonna be more on the chill side which you kind of need the differences you know roll call was real fancy real classy this one is a little bit more casual but a vibe regardless again there's no cost associated with this event because you already registered you already paid it so it's all included, just like how Jesus paid it all. Yeah, you already paid it all when you registered with Fantasy Tribe. So this is gonna be a really cool event. It's um, Sunday, February 19th from 12 to seven. And then you can also, as I said, register at fantasytribe.com to get access to this event. And then it's gonna be, the location of this event is in a D Threads yard, which is in Canefield. So very exciting. This is like, this event, I can just tell, is gonna like, if you're not already in the carnival mood, by this event, this is gonna put you into it because the big truck will be there, the band will be practicing, your people that you're gonna be on the road with is gonna be there. Very, very excited for this event. Okay, so if by chance you're not registered for Fantasy Tribe, I'm very much side eyeing you. There are two other events that you could attend. I'm not gonna talk much about it because you really should be in Fantasy Tribe and you really should be at band practice, okay? So we're just gonna to quickly touch on it. It's the first one is Opulence, that is a brunch. And then the second one is Pink Nick, that is a, an upscale picnic, okay? That's all we're gonna say about those two events because they're happening at the same time as uh, band practice and you're supposed to be at band practice, but I'll still put the information for you in the description box, but I'm not gonna spend my time talking, okay? All right, so we're still on Sunday, okay? We're placing ourselves on Sunday. The next event that you could possibly attend on Sunday, February 19th, is a Sauce and Punch. This event is an all-white party because you already know Caribbean people. We gotta have an all-white party. Like, it's not a it's not carnival season if there's not an all-white party. Gotta have an all-white party. So this is an all-white affair. I've been to this event before. I will be honest, when I went in 2019, I didn't really enjoy myself because of just how the place was set up. It was in a very small location and getting drinks was a hassle. But now it's gonna be at the Old Mill Cultural Center. So that's gonna be a much better setup. And I just think that will make it automatically be a little bit better just because the setup will be better. You can get tickets at ticketpalcaribbean.com. It will be linked below. This event is from 4 p.m. to 11 p.m. So you can definitely leave band practice right at seven, go home, change your clothes, put your all white on, and go to South and Punch. Signal Band will also be performing at this event. This event is put on by the Rotary Club. So it's kind of sort of a fundraiser event. So, you know, Fundraising and partying, having a good time, you know, you're doing something for the cause, why not? Okay, you guys, we're getting to the main events. We're getting into the main events. And so we are up now on Monday, but it's like really early Monday. We are in turn into Juve. Ah! Juve just is a different kind of energy. It's a different kind of vibe. And of course, 
we're doing Jubilee with illumination like who else there's no one else needed to be mentioned okay we're doing Juve with Illumination. If you are in Fantasy Tribe, you already have your ticket for Illumination. You don't even have to worry. Because, as I said, you already paid it all. One registration, five events. We were not joking, okay? So, I don't have to worry about Illumination because I'm in Fantasy Tribe, okay? But if you're not in Fantasy Tribe, you can still register for Illumination. The VIP is already sold out. Sorry, but you snooze, you lose. That should just tell you how good of a Juve Illumination is because the VIP tickets sold out real, real, real quick. But um, this is February 20th, Juve time. Uh, where to register? FantasyTribe.com. Location, we gonna be all over the streets, okay? We gonna be on the streets. We're gonna be following the big truck and it's gonna be vibes, paint, powder, lights, everything. Tut bitte, tut bagai, okay? I am very excited. Oh, it's gonna be a vibe. It's going to be a vibe. I can like already like feel it. I can feel it. After Juve, you're gonna go rest up a little bit and then we have Carnival Monday. With Fantasy Tribe, you do get a included ticket to Cluebirds. Uh, Cluebirds is not a, a, a product of Signal Band but they're gonna be the ones on the road with Cluebirds. There's also Mega, Mon Mega Monday, um, and there's some other options as well. I will kind of like put those in the description box, but, but of course, I'm Fantasy Tribe influencer, so all I'm talking about for real, for real, is gonna be what Fantasy Tribe is offering from here on out, okay? <laughs> and then we have Carnival Tuesday, Pretty Mask, the day of the parade, the day of the costumes, no other than fantasy tribe if you're watching this video and you want to play mass and you're undecided the only band for you is fantasy tribe okay deanna said it d scurve said it like when have i ever stirred you wrong never i can't think of a time i have not okay so i will not start now fantasy tribe you can't go wrong. The costumes are absolutely beautiful. I just know the experience on the road is gonna be a vibe. You heard me mention all the other events you're getting, okay? Roll call, band practice, cool birds, illumination, and now Fantasy Tribe. That's five events for your one registration. You cannot go wrong. If it's still available, I would say register for the Golden Sulfur section because that's my section. But you know, I'm a little biased. We'll take you in any section though, for real, for real. But I'm very excited. Ah, just can't wait. Just can't wait for partying in the streets. Mass Alawi, which is the theme of 2023's carnival, which is party in the streets. Lawi is the streets. And it's just so fitting because last year we couldn't party in the streets because of you know what. And this year, we're gonna make up for that. We're making up for all the lost times last year. I'm so very excited. There's one other event that I wanted to mention. This event is called Carnival Beat. This is an event that's happening every Friday up until February 26th, and it's at Petite Miami. This is, like, if you just wanna catch a vibe on Friday night, like, this is the place to be. They have DJs. It's a real chill vibe, you know, it's free to enter, you can just buy your drinks and stuff, go with your group of friends, DJs, um, they may have some artists on, depending on the Friday that you go. It's gonna be a vibe, you know, I've never been to Petit Miami and I am, I really, really want to go at least one of the Fridays that I'm there. Because I see all the posts from Petit Miami, it looks like a small Miami like it looks like a vibe who doesn't like Miami we all know partying in Miami is a vibe and so they've tried to like kind of duplicate that energy that vibe there and so I am very excited to attend again as I said it's every Friday up until February 26 it's free to enter just bring your friends bring the vibe and come down to Carnival Beat Whew. you guys that was a lot okay that was a lot shout out to all of the promoters all of the organizers shout out to fantasy tribe and signal band shout out to viva la carnival shout out to wind down like we're about to have a time we are about to have a time if you're undecided these are the parties that you should consider 
all of the information will be in the description box you guys please share this video let people know that there's two carnivals happening in february okay at least two i don't know there may be another one but there's at least two happening okay and dominica is definitely on the map dominica is happening it's gonna be a vibe we're gonna be partying in the streets and i really cannot wait to see you there if this video was helpful give it a thumbs up ask questions in the comments down below i'll be happy to answer them Follow me over on Instagram because I'm going to be sharing outfit inspo. You guys already know the vibe, okay? You guys already know the vibe. If you have any questions about attending carnival in general, please leave them down below and I'll be happy to answer those as well. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!